So AmeriCorps is a national government community service program. Our program specifically in C stands for National Civilian Community Corps where uh, our program is a 10 month residential program for 18 to 24 year olds where we get to travel around the country doing community service. Well a lot of us uh, just want to get out here and serve. I think a huge, a huge uh, reason to get out here is you know you want to see that benefit in the community. You, in, Another reason is we get to travel and get to learn all about the different areas around the country. Like our team alone has been to, to Puerto Rico, to Massachusetts, we're here, we've been in Florida. We've done anything from home building to hurricane relief to working with children. It's, it's, you get a wide range of experiences that is a lot of fun and you get to help the community at the same time. We had a ton of damage uh, where, where bridges were, were um, demolished and, and knocked into the creeks and um, in some ways we can't afford, uh, the city has no uh, repair or uh, replacement money for those bridges. So this one here that the AmeriCorps team is working on now is actually rerouting um, the trail to avoid having to rebuild the bridge. Basically the, the bank sunk in um, and would make what was a 35 foot bridge uh, now we need to build a 55 to 60 foot bridge just to span the same gap. This reroute here will open up uh, the, all of Beaver Trail. Okay, currently there's over a mile or about a mile of Beaver Trail still closed. Once this reroute is finished, Beaver Trail reopens and knocks yet another mile off of our list of uh, trails that, that still need repair. And basically we have four miles left that are still closed. And so it, this is a great piece of the puzzle where this team's coming out and giving us the manpower to reroute. And I'll say it's, it's um, about 1,200 linear feet of trail, so it's, it's not an easy task. I haven't done this before. Like, we're all volunteers, not professionals. But um, that's kind of what's cool about the program. You get to dip your toe in a lot of different types of work. Yeah. You know, uh, it's great. Um, you know, I wouldn't trade it. It's, um, I came here from college. I uh, went to like a small liberal arts place in Pennsylvania mm -hmm. and um, I just wanted to try something different. Uh, but this is great because, um, I mean, I like it for the travel. You see a lot, you know, you kind of, it gives you a good chance to learn and grow. Uh, people in AmeriCorps usually are um, recent high school graduates, recent college graduates, or transferring from Job Corps. We had the uh, Appalachian Trail Club also involved in laying this out and planning for it. And some of those club members, um, it's the Natural Bridge, Bridge Appalachian Trail Club. Some of those members offered the idea of these, these uh, smaller stream crossings uh, to put in a, what, what they're calling a low water ford. And it's essentially these round uh, jumping stones or, or stepping stones to step across the water. So then when the water rises, there's no wood structure like a bridge to be destroyed again. It just goes up, the trail closes for a couple days, and it goes down, and the stepping stones are still there. So they'll be in, uh, put a, installed with rebar and poured, poured and formed concrete. No, no, it's not, it's not the easiest job. Sometimes you, we'll be working like 60 hours a week in the sun in 90 degrees or will be, uh, um, it could be as cold as in the high 20s and windy. Um, we, we worked like that when we were in Massachusetts and we, uh, honestly I'd say just the experience itself 
like getting to know all these sort of different things is it's it's very interesting to to say I can now I can go um, I can cut down a tree or I can I can build my own house now I can build or at least some parts of my house now and um, I can I can help with children I can help do all sorts of different things now and it just the experience is what's awesome.